The stack pattern allows you to create either a vertical or horizontal stack of elements. It provides a convenient way to group elements together while maintaining uniform spacing between them. To use stack as a function, import it from styled system slash patterns and pass the following properties to it. Direction, this gives the flex direction of the stack. By default, stack has a column direction but you can set it to a row direction based on your use case. Gap is another property that defines the spacing between the elements inside the stack. Let's say we have these three divs and we want to stack them together. So we go in and we grab stack here and give it a gap of six, which means 24 pixels. And here's what we have. Edge stack is a wrapper around the stack pattern that specifically sets the direction property to horizontal and vertically centers elements within it. So let's horizontally stack these divs. We grab our edge stack pattern and we can give some spacing using the gap property. For this, let's maintain a gap of six, which implies 24 pixels. VStack is another wrapper around the stack pattern but this time it sets the direction property to vertical. It also centers the elements horizontally within the container. From our previous example, we can easily stack these divs vertically and simply switch our H stack to V stack. The major difference between V stack and stack is that V stack centers elements horizontally. So there you have it. Now go ahead and explore stack, H stack, and V stack patterns.